All right, welcome back, everybody. Just found a Charmander here. Actually, it didn't take me very long this time. I think it might be a swarm going right now. Oh yeah, uh, I don't. I didn't mention this before, but <clears throat> what happens is sometimes when you go into an area where you can find starter Pokemon, uh, there'll be like a whole ton of them at one at one time. So you don't have to look for like you know ten minutes, fifteen minutes at a time before you finally find one because they're all like right out there. <clears throat> okay, so well, Charmander. Yeah, so here I am at the base of Mount Ember, and uh, I actually went ahead and looked ahead just to see, uh, nail down where you could find Bulbasaur and Charm uh, Squirtle in the wild, and turns out that I'm really close by the area. I mean, it's just a matter of me getting the, uh, the Rainbow Pass, which makes you able to access all seven islands, and they're like on the, uh, was it the Six Islands? I think it is the Six Island. <clears throat> so... As soon as I catch the Charmander, we'll just proceed with the quest, and when I'm able to, go ahead and catch us uh, Bulbasaur and Squirtle. What else is nice about this area is that you can capture Magmar here. I think I need to correct something that I said earlier. Uh, you actually can catch Magmar in the basement of, uh, what is that, that Cinnabar burned out mansion? Yes, caught Charmander. <coughs> It just takes a little while, but if you're catching Magmar here, it's a lot better because, you know, you're going to be looking for Charmander anyway. Um, there we go. Ah, uh, Ultra Ball. Okay, and while I'm waiting for that thing to capture, let me open this up real quick. Okay, implement Pokemon in their locations. Okay, so here's where you find Pelt, uh, Pelt, uh, Viridian, Control Find, uh, Squirtle. Okay, two island Cape Rink. Okay, so that's where you can find Squirtle. Guaranteed. So, Bulbasaur. I better be safe about this. Bulbasaur. Three island Berry Forest. Okay, is there anywhere else you can catch Bulbasaur? Oh, no. Okay. Well, never mind. I was wrong. Um. Oh, and I caught the Squirtle. Okay, it's serious. Its IVs are kind of crap. Okay. Well, anyway, um, in that case... <laughs> so Charmander is here on one island at the base of Mount Ember, Squirtle is at Cape Rink here, and Bulbasaur is at Berry Forest, where we actually were whenever we were looking for Lost Cell. Alright, caught it. Got all the starters there. Oh crap, Lax, it's the same exact nature as my Venusaur. Okay, adamant. So that's higher attack, less special attack, so it's not that great for Charmander. <sighs> and I got low speed to effort values as well. I guess I could breed this thing, but I don't really want to. Uh, whatever. If, I mean, if I breed it with the Ditto that's got pretty good uh, abilities and a high speed, might still be able to make this work. Anyway, let's get out of this area. You know what? As long as I'm here... I didn't consider this before, but it would be pretty cool to competitively explosion. Well, I would terrified to teach explosion. Okay. Oh crap! I guess it doesn't. Uh, I n I didn't use this guy yet. I guess it's gonna cost you every time you wanna uh, use somebody to teach a move. All right, you're terribly brave. Which Pokemon? Okay, normally I wouldn't even consider it, but since I'm here, let's go ahead and teach Metagross explosion. <coughs> uh, let's see. What do I want to get rid of? I don't see me using agility here. You see Explosion has base power 250, although... <laughs> see, if I were faster than the enemy Pokemon and I blew myself up, that would make sense, but... Eh, you know what, screw it. I'm getting rid of agility. Okay, so I've got a Metagross that's already got really high attack power. If it explodes, uh, it, pre it pretty much is going to take down everybody around it. So it might be good for double battles if you got... Um... A friend Pokemon that's got to uh, protect. <coughs> Alright, moving on forward. Up, 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 up. I'm deliberately uh, ignoring the chat here, but sometimes I see things that I really don't want to see. Okay, forward. Yeah, there's a difference between being funny and just plain being immature and annoying. Too many people don't know that difference. I'm really not a prude, it's just... You know, when you hear it day after day after day, it kind of grinds on your nerves after a while. Okay, I think this is the right way. I'm pretty sure it is. Come on, hurry up. 
Come on, push the boulder, push the boulder. There we go. Down here, uh, here's a bunch of gibberish writing that I don't care about. I mean, if I click on it, this is what happens. So I'm not even going to mess with that. <clears throat> and here's the ruby. Alright, now I could uh, try to push my way out here, but I got another escape rope, so I'm just going to go ahead and use that. It was my last escape rope, so I think what I'm going to do is, as soon as I'm able to, first chance I get, I'll buy a couple more of them. They're pretty cheap, so should be fine. Hey there. Oh, the, the, that got, gave him the ruby. Thank you, you're simply amazing. I need to ask one more giant favor, and it is a giant favor. There's another gem that forms a pair with the ruby. It's the uh, sapphire. Okay, so extra page town map and got the rainbow pass. It'll let you get to all the Sevi Islands. I can't do this without your help. All right. Uh, all right, I'm just going to go over here real quick. Hey there, did you expand your inventory? Merchandise is limited. Oh, okay, he didn't expand his inventory. Is there one on three islands? Okay, he's further up, though. Never mind, screw it. I'll just try to get the Pokemon at four island. Hi there. Let's go to four island. <coughs> Not gonna go to any island at all, but it's better if you just uh, go in the order that you see it. Hey, Veltor, what are you doing on the Sevi Island? You should quit copying me. Anyway, I got Pokemon eggs, so I'm done with the island. I'll bet you don't know anything about Pokemon eggs. Alright, why don't you go around after you a little curious? Smelling ya. Well, he either really likes or really hates the way I smell. No, I'm not, don't use another Metro Bell. Alright, so... Into the Pokemon we go. You selling escape ropes, dude? Pokeball, Ripple, blah, 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 blah. There it is, escape rope. I'll buy, like, three of them. Like I said, they're really inexpensive, so it hardly dents your uh, wallet. Okay, we hope to see you again. So, this is the place uh, where you can breed in the Kanto region. I mean, since you have breeding available in the, jo uh, the Hoenn region, it really doesn't matter, but... As a precaution, again, if you're going to be breeding Pokémon, you're going to lose the two parents. Maybe I can demonstrate. I'm a daycare man. I breed Pokémon to help their potential. How about a trade? I'll keep two of your Pokémon in return. I'll give you an egg. No, screw you, man. Breeding is useful if you know exactly what you're doing, but, eh. Oh, wait, 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 hold on a sec. Was that guy always there? Hi there. Ooh, Chili, I made a slushy using shaved ice from Icefall Cave. That doesn't help me at all. Maybe if you have an ice-type Pokemon, he gives you something, I don't know. Anyway, I could go through Icefall Cave here and get the HM Waterfall, but I already have it, so... Let's just use the waterfall, and this goes so quick if you actually have what you need. <coughs> Alright, so in here, this is an excellent place to, uh, to use Payday if you got a Persian. And in short order, I am going to be catching a Persian, like once I get to Seven Island, or whenever I get uh, Persian stuff. I mean, there's some okay stuff you can pick up in this cave, but I didn't want to waste your time with it. Keep your filthy hands off the Pokemon in this cave. Do as I say, you have me to answer. Now, if it were any trainer other than one in a rocket uniform, would you be saying this? Oh, shut up, lady, and leave us be. Well, Veltor, what are you doing here? Now, nah, I need your help. Uh, help me kick these poachers out. They've been catching Pokemon here and selling them off. Uh, hello? Catching Pokemon, selling them off. Tra trading Vulpix Shiny, selling camera up, 15 million. <laughs> you know? Are you ready? You take that one, please. What? Who says we can't do what we want with the Pokemon we catch? I'm with the Rockets on this one. Now screw you, I'm a Team Rocket sympathizer, Lorelei. <coughs> Alright, so Zubat, face you with Dragonite. No offense, I'm just doing this in order to get through the plot. Sorry, Team Rocket. So yeah, the gold bat, just knock that thing right back down, sit back down. And I think that this is the place where you can catch a Lapras, like right by this water's edge. I mean, you have to surf around in the water for a long time before you find a wild Lapras in here. But, I mean, if you really want one and you don't like the one that you got as your gift Pokemon, like mine wasn't very good, I just haven't had all that much luck with IVs. Huh, so despicably bleak. Yeah, you can catch one in this water. Where have you taken the captured Pokemon? I'm smashing your ring. I'm not telling you that. You won't confess. We'll deep freeze you. Go, Lapras Ice Beam. No, okay, I'll talk. They're in the Rocket Warehouse on Five Islands. I'll do you ever make it there, though. Ah. 
Lorelai, you had no right to attack a human with a Pokemon. I mean, even in the Pokemon game, doesn't that, like, violate some sort of ethical code? Okay. Dragon that you surf. Screw Helix. I am the enemy of the Helix fossil. I mean, not like Ammonite Nomastar, just fine, but the people who say hail Helix just screw you guys. Hi there, would you like to board to Five Islands? Sure. Actually, I don't think that there's anything I can do here right now. Um, honestly, I really just need to get to Six Island, but I just thought I'd show you guys real quick what it looks like, and I better just uh, go into this Pokemon Center for now because I don't know if I'll be able to fly here if I don't. Yeah, you could kind of just uh, cut right through Five Islands. And I think there's stuff to pick up and stuff, but I'm not going to worry about that right now because I just want to move ahead with the plot. Six Islands. Here we are. Alright, so Six Island. This is the place where you can capture uh, the starter Pokemon. <clears throat> but before I do that, let's go ahead down here real quick. Uh, Pokemon on the Grassland. And I think that Seven Island is where you catch Larvitar in the Grasslands. But, uh, oops. Just going through these Grasslands real quick give you a brief idea of what you can find in here. Ah, man, come on. <clears throat> Another Fero. Yes, yes, let me flee, please. What? I can't escape? Come on. I'm like, how many levels ha higher am I? 62 minus 48. What is that, 14 levels? My math is a little off at the moment. Jeez, another wild battle. You know, normally I'd use a repel here, but... Oh yeah, I said I was going to get another repel. Okay, well, as soon as I've got uh, what I want from down here, I'll use another repel. No, no, I won't. I'll buy more repel. There we are, dragon scale. If any of you want to catch a horsey, make it into a kingdra, that's where you find the dragon scale to do so. Whoops, didn't mean to go there. Come on. Hey, Veltor, how's your Pokedex feeling? Oh, hello, Gary. Looks like it's impossible to get all the Pokemon hanging around just these parts. Maybe there are Pokemon we don't know far away. Well, if I can find it, there's no way... If I can't do it, there's no way you can get it done. I'm not going to get desperate over this. I'll keep collecting Pokemon on my own pace. That's what I'll do. There's no point staying here. I might as well leave for home. That's it, then. Smell ya. All right, later, dude. Oh, okay. Well, I guess since I kicked off the event in there, hopefully it'll let me fly to this island now. Hey, might I help you? Yes, I'd like to get more repels, please. There we are. Max repel. I'm just gonna buy like 20 of these. There we go, now I'm gonna run no risk of running out of those things again. I wonder if I should have bought more hyper potions. Nah, I'm not gonna worry about that, right?